Welcome to my uh, let's play of my hack. Somewhat an easy type hack, but it's mostly just a uh, slight change. I use this file so I can see. Oh, yeah, see, Excalibur provides. Uh, I gave it a few LF things. The Night Sword pushes it to sleep. Axe is paralyzed. Giant's Axe is doomed. Cat Claw has silence. The Charm Claw has more status. Has sleep, blind, and confused. And the Dragon Claw does everything. The Mega Grenade, the Jumbo Bombs, and Mega Grenades. Uh, the make both of them do confuse. And the Mega Grenade is an aerial attack, so... And the Bow of Grace adds silence, too. And yeah, the Apollo Helm now protects from... Oh. I meant to do Guy's Iron of Earth, but the Apollo Helm protects from Earth and Doom. So... Guy's Armor I left the same Age of Shield, I added Drain from the community, like, uh... And the cubist locket is the same. And the shield and the So we have pretty good elemental defense. We have pretty, pretty protected now. So, and. We can't see it because, but you'll see, uh, I left the steel. I left the steel sword and the axe alone because uh, they're powerful enough. And I changed the cat claw. Oh, we saw. Let's load the cat claw. Made the cat claw a bit stronger. The charm claw I only increased a little bit, and the dragon claw I just kept the same. Pretty sure. test because I edited things and I made sure uh, enemy names and attack names were missing a letter at the beginning. I had to edit all of them to fix that. But this is the three point version three point one on my patch of my hack. So things should work better. Everything should be balanced and I fix things. Any of the text you can just watch my other let's play to see it. I just want to get through this game fairly fast so we can see all the good, see everything, and make sure it works. Yeah, I left the steel sword alone. See, it's just 25 damage, and crit will still be 75.
Who's a steel sword? As soon as you get level two, it can kill the enemies in level four, so. And then you get the axe. And then you can hit level four on your own. charges there and my spells. When I rest, it will refill in what I've changed it to. See, we still have to... My magic is... Ah, my accuracy kicked in. So we have two more accuracy and a few more magic points. Those will help in the end game. The accuracy especially will make your accuracy even. At least this time they actually kicked in and didn't kick in before. All we need is a couple more points at the end game, and right now a couple points is like a couple level ups or so. Worth. So this time we'll grab Kaylee right away because we need her. Uh... We need her. Uh first so we don't have to rest twice because she'll have more charges of her of white magic and she has uh she also has a cure spell because why would she have life and not cure this because i know for each of the red chests it respawns for each person it uh yeah see it's cure in our own village. I also changed. I also took the A off the relic uh, armor. Made a relic armor. It's a relic, you know. And her axe is still the same. Like her, you know. We're keep gonna use and the resistance flares work this time. I didn't show this dialogue for last time. You talk to him before you take the chest, and he'll tell you to take it. And then when you talk to him after you get it, he'll say, "Oh, Keely can talk to tree spirits." I'll, uh, I'll get the, um, chest. I have eight charges of white and four of black. So that's, we start, I sort of, I was gonna give myself wizard, but I did decide to did it in the end. So you know, just increasing my charges of white and black a little bit. And she has, yeah, she has a cure in life. So. I'll save state here. Magic will fix once you go into a battle. 
And yeah, I have Kaylee's speed. It was supposed to be 16, but... Or, I don't know. Or, no, I don't know. Her stats are supposed to be something, but... Just had to continue the next part of my video. I'm watching my videos to make sure and see how things go. Sorry, bear with me, it's lagging. Now the reason she's doing more damage also is because of the, of the resistance glitch. I left Keeley's and uh, Tristan's defense, uh, I think I edited Tristan's defense by a couple points, but I left Keeley alone because yeah, that way it's a little challenging, and she doesn't take any damage anyways. Now we can auto these guys. she just missed. So it's only a minor tweaks. The major tweaks will be Tristan when he rejoins and Phoebe when she rejoins. I put their accuracy to 96. So.
give him more gold. Oh no, he already gives us 30 gold, I think. But other enemies, I increase the gold.
Yeah, I gave that Battlefield 6 more experience. Just so it's an even number. Alright, I was gonna... Fire gives the uh, gives the not shaking, so it's actually easier on the eyes if I use fire. Oh, but if I get a strike first, I'll physically attack. I'll be skipping picking up ninja stars in the dungeon this time. You've already seen pretty much what every brown chest in the game is. Uh, there's one brown chest I changed. That's it. Because I thought it would be appropriate for it to be there because there's a lady in Windy who will sell seeds after the wind dies down, but like, where did she gather seeds? Well, I put a chest in a place that makes it logical. I think Tristan's higher speed is helping us get strike first. Because it's based on speed of the party. And also, Tristan will go first uh, more often now. See how useful Tristan is now, even more so? Just taking care of these enemies with fire. And if I need to do a more power, wait. Oh. And his ninja stars are exactly the same power, so. But as our red mage, she'll have to keep healing because his charge will make the dungeon go faster. Well, we 
lift to it? Okay, that's more than enough. Actually, no, let's still get the bottles half price. If he, he's nice enough to cut us a deal, if we say, sorry, let's take advantage of that. Actually, weirdly, uh, kind of like exponential growth, not quite square or something, but. There's no way the bomb's attack power itself is 14, so I added two points to it. Now, the original bombs are not aerial, so they just. Uh, this room, because it's actually a good room for experience, although I'm getting low experience, which is good and bad. Yeah, about 
but yeah, I needed that extra level to kill it with Max. So I had to use Cure last level. test that in my other game, my last game. We're just grabbing these three seeds. We're not farming seeds right now. Thank <laughs> you. 
much smoother. And I'm not even level 10. I'm only level 7. This is the lowest level I think I've ever probably finished the Bone Dungeon in a while. Yeah, that attack was called Scrunch, but I changed the F off and just made it Crunch. It sounds better that way. Use it here 
this bell here. Oh yeah, this battlefield like beats the gold just by 30. Just, you know. Oh no, I must have left with one fifty. Oh, it's me still ah, whatever. It's, it's gold. It's an amount. Blizzard because it's you know in the focus tower too and fire and thunder so oh. her magic will be 50 64 because I may give her five more magic and 46 speed. And I gave her 80 uh, eight, uh, 80 for accuracy. A couple more points of accuracy. I gave the cat claw silence to. Oh, she her magic is 52. It's 57 right now with the claw. Her speed's 48. Just to show you. Okay, two levels 
reset reload the page because my the finale of my playthrough just lo loaded or just got mm, it was uploaded So just enough to be nice. Maybe 20 points more.
one bombs and then throw another bombs. Or three bombs. Every, uh, 
because I grew up all the same, so I can just battle. After I get to the last battle, I'll just explore it. I was sort of trying to die so I get my quake charge back, but oh well. Thank you. 
think this is uh, dangerous for me. I 
didn't know I wanted to clear these guys out until now. Because I want to go back, when I get, have to go back to the, uh, Wintry Temple, I want to.
trying to avoid picking up the refreshers. Do it when we get Reuben. We just needed uh, some protection in this early area. Thank you. 
finish this battlefield, I'll call it an episode. I just noticed my game time was over an hour, so... Thank <laughs> you. 